Hi kids! Isang matatag na araw. I'm Sir Noy and welcome to Mat Bilang. In this video, you will learn how to estimate the result of multiplying two numbers where the product is less than 1 million. But first, let's have a review of rounding off numbers. Round each number to the nearest 100,000 and choose among the two given numbers. Let's start! Two hundred thousand. Six hundred thousand. Eight hundred thousand. Let's learn the multiplication sentence. Again, the number placed above the multiplication sign is the multiplicand, and the number Place after the multiplication sign is multiplier, and the answer is product. Let's now estimate the result of multiplying two numbers where the product is less than 1 million. Let's multiply these two numbers. 321 times 46. Let's round off each factor to the highest place value. 2 is the next digit after 3, since 2 is round down so 321 will become 300 and 6 is the next digit after 4 and 6 is round up so 46 will become 50 so after we round off these two numbers 300 times 50 we will multiply the digits which are not zeros so 3 times 5 is 15 and count all the zeros. 1, 2, 3. And we will put these th three zeros in our product. So the result is 15,000. Another one. Let's round off each factor to the highest place value. 7 is the digit after 5. 7 is round up. So 573 will become 600. 9 is the digit after 3. 9 is round up, so 3 will become 400. So 600 times 400, we will multiply the digits which are not zeros. So 6 times 4 is 24. We will count all the zeros. We have 4 zeros, and we will put these zeros in our product. So the final product is... 240,000 Another one 7,029 times 87 Let's round off each factor to the highest place value Let's start from our multiplicand Since 2 is a round down So 7 will become 7,000 And 7 in 87 is round up so 87 will become 90. Multiply the digits which are not zeros. 7 times 9 is 63. And we have 4 zeros. The final product is 630,000. Another one. Let's round off each factor to the highest place value. So 0 is round down so 504 will become 500 8 is round up 781 will be rounded up to 800 so 8 times 5 is 40 and we have these four zeros we will put this in our product so our final product is 400,000 Let's try! Estimate the product. Two forty nine will become two hundred. Four ninety eight will become five hundred. And the estimated product is one hundred thousand. Another one. Another one. 
958 will become 1000 48 will become 50 and the estimated product is 50,000 another one Two thousand four hundred fifty six will become two thousand. Two fifty five will become three hundred. And the estimated product is six hundred thousand. Activity time! Activity number one Check whether the estimation is correct. Let's answer. Number one is correct. Number two is incorrect. Number three, incorrect. Number four, correct. Activity number two, estimate the product. Let's answer. The estimated product in number 1 is 20,000. Number 2. The estimated product for number 2 is 18,000. Number 3. 120,000. Number 4. 500,000. Always remember, when estimating products, round the factors to simpler values. Multiply the numbers which are not zeros. Count all the zeros present in the factors and check if the estimate is reasonable compared to the original numbers. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel and like my Facebook page. Happy learning!